This is a case of intax implantation. The center of the cornea is marked. The guide is inked, placed on the central marking, peripheral pachymetry is performed, and the incision is made at approximately 70% of the pachymetry. Once the incision is made, a Sinsky hook is used to delineate the bottom of the incision, and then this is sequentially enlarged with sequentially larger lamellar dissectors. The incision is aligned with the steep axis. The channel creators are inserted below the largest lamellar dissector and then rotated for approximately 180 degrees. The same process is done with the superior channel. The eye is held in the correct position via vacuum. Once the channels have been successfully created, the intact segments can be fed into the channels, as demonstrated here with the inferior intact segment. The same process is again accomplished with the superior intact segment. A Sinsky hook is used to push the proximal border of the intact segments approximately one to two millimeters beyond the incision. The incision is then sutured with a single interrupted 10 nylon suture and the suture is tightened to prevent fish mouthing of the incision. And that concludes the case.